was just messing around today and um, I wanted to show you another little tip to be kind of thing that I do. I don't know why I feel the need to do these, but I just thought, oh well. When you, you know how you always want to make lines, your stripes or whatever you want to call them on the side of your furniture. So I was just going to show you how I do it because I got, I do it very easy. I eye up all my work. I very seldom measure anything because I'm just, I just don't do that. But how I do it and I keep track of it is by this, that I've cut off the roll. And that's how I can keep my distance. Now, if I was doing all stripe, I would probably do a, uh, or the wide ones, I would do um, the wide, but I'm going to rotate stripes on this. I thought that would be something a little different. So I got my little piece up here, which I started with it over here and then put the thick one down. So then I'm just going to go ahead and lay this. And I'm sure a lot of you do this, so don't think I think I've created something. <laughs> I'm just thinking of newer people that get into painting or Maybe someone doesn't, didn't realize to do this. And I just move my little piece of tape and it doesn't have to sit in there straight because you just need one part of it there to be even. That's how, what, I can't one hand stuff anymore. Okay. And then just keep, I just keep coming down and eye that up too. So, and then I'm gonna move to my next row where I'm gonna need a thicker, thick piece because I'm gonna go ahead and put a thick, thick piece of tape on there. I'm just doing these oddly different. These are a couple of those dressers I've been working on that I've been decoupaging a lot. And I have this one, I'm working on two right now and then I have one more, oops, that's perfect, one more to make. So see, I just eye everything up. I don't measure and lines and I think you can pretty much eye stuff up and just it's it's turns out perfect okay and like I said this is just something that I do and for me it makes it faster so I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna rotate back now to this the thinner um paint tape and I'm gonna put the next line on that. Um, these, I'm trying to do a little extra to, to these dressers because these were poor, poor little dressers. Um, this one came to me with no top and um, it was all painted in this dark green color and covered with stickers. But it was the cutest, I just saw the potential. So I'm also gonna have to come up with some creative top for it, but I have just decoupaged all the drawers. But I wanted to do um, something else to it and give it a little bit of sass on its side, which I think it's gonna turn out really good. I'll finish up here and then I'll put my paint on. And oop, I'm sorry, I left my tripod in the Suburban. Um, and I'll have this posted because I have a little picture I'm going to post too about the drawers. I did them a little different. My decoupaging, I did that a little different. So if this helps, I hope so. Remember, all it takes is one little piece off the, for a guide and you can move along real fast. All right, till the next time.